We saw gas prices start to skyrocket. Now we're watching as they're coming down slowly, putting more money in your pocket. Sacramento at 520 for a gallon of regular Stockton uh, up one cent, 521. Modesto in a little bit lower at 512. The lowest price we could find in Northern California, it's Yuba City at 510. Lowest price in the state, El Centro 504. California's average still a very high. 531. Well, gas prices are coming down. That's the good news, Walt. But That's right. But a lot of folks want to know about the number after the period. The Y guy was asked about the nine tenths. Here's what he found. Today's Y guy question from Risa. Why are prices at the gas station listed with a nine tenth at the end? Why not round it off? Risa, it's crazy to think about it, but back in the 1930s, gas was under 10 cents a gallon. So if you added one cent to a gallon of gas that now costs 10 cents, that's a markup of 10%. That might have caused a revolt. So to soften the increase, gas station owners boosted the price by 9 tenths of a cent, so the price wouldn't be a full penny increase. From Patrick DeHaan at Gas Buddy, quote, back in the old days, the tax was added on, nine-tenths of a penny, but it stuck as prices evolved and increased, end of quote. So the nine-tenths of a penny is still with us since the Great Depression, although it's meaningless in today's economy. Why? It's marketing. It's the same reason why a car is listed for sale at $99.99 instead of $10,000. It feels like a better deal. The nine-tenths of a penny listed price is something that started 90 years ago and for no good reason is still in existence today. I love a story that ends with, well, there's no good reason for that. <laughs> if you have a Why Guy question, reach me at my Facebook page, Walt Gray News. You can watch more Why Guy stories at abc10.com slash whyguy.